Sounds nice, doesn't it? I don't need whores. I don't need whores. I've been told I'm quite... Yes, nice. exactly. Yeah. Buy whores. <laughs> My point is, with enough coin, we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. That's true. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? It's all an excuse to tell everyone else what to do. Good point, Beska. I have them sometimes. Just remember, we have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're going to be rich. This is pretty awesome. Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. Yep, sure, why not? To us. Aye, to us. <laughs> Best of you when the time is right. There you go. Perfect timing. Why was the person at the wrong time? Do I look very Slayers silly? Put the bounty on Bizarre. They did. With his own gold. Mm. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Oh, is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again! Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? Now cut your fucking throats! Tavern's closed. What are you doing here? Where is he? Where's who? Here. 400 dragons. No. They must be working for the Wise Masters. And that's all you're getting. Fuck you! He's worth twice that. <laughs> Look at the balls on this one. Yes. Give me my money. Give us a hundred and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Bloody hell! And we're done with you too. La da diri sombasi. Do ebi me. Don't talk to my men. You just made a huge mistake. To oh. You two are going to be useful to me for really? once. Really? Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asha Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. Oh really? How he wouldn't take less than eight hundred gold. Well, that's true. So he killed Bezak instead. That's a lie. Luckily. We were there to deliver Yes, luckily you got your ass the money kicked. Yes. Ponte Osinas! Fordros me nomi Jahosu Kisikas! I love the Villarian tongue. Um, yeah, we got the foot table, why not? Alright, who dies first? Who wants to dance on the end of the sword? Oh, I'm being attacked. Kill them! Now! Dig it in the face! Face. Can I not use a weapon yet? Oh. There you go. Kind of like that, but more chopping in the head, I think. I like doing it in the head. Uh, no, you don't. Um, okay. Hey, I needed that. Stop trying to kill me. Uh, you. I don't like you. Oh, that was probably the wrong. Oh, there you go. You owe me one. She's kind of killing everybody. By the way, take it in the head. I told you I like it in the head. You didn't listen, did you? Stop this inappropriate behaviour. This is highly inappropriate. There you go. Thank you for the help, though. I appreciate the assistance, sir. Uh, of course, she takes a kill. Kill Steela. Stop kill stealing. Uh, yes, get off it. You, you chose poorly. That's mine. By the way. No, you missed. Yes, enjoy. Asha. 
Uh, yes. <laughs> Thanks for the <laughs> assistance again. That was easy. You know what this reminds me of? <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. It does. The monster kill. <laughs> yeah. I think she's kicking. You kill me. And the Lost Legion won't stop. Really? Until you and your friend are dead. Well, how about if I just give you a bit of extra pain? <laughs> Enjoy. You deserve that, if I'm honest. What, he died? He just shut up. Um, yes! To soul. Kill them both! <laughs> okay. Wait, what? What? No, I, I dodged. I clearly dodged. Oh, hi. Who are you? I don't know, but you have a nice mustache. That must mean you're an ally. Yeah, I agree. Who the fuck is he? My uncle. His uncle. Oh, it's welcome. More on their way. We need to go. Yes, I want the money. We're not leaving without the money. Surely. It's the most important thing here. She's covered in blood. Malcolm. I think I do like her. Please send us money. Damn. God damn it. We have to keep moving. Look like very Malcolm, valuable stop. cutlery though. I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Brad, right, you're gonna go. Oh, okay, please. I'll catch you later. I'm Thanks for stopping by. Oh. Well, we know you are correct there, good sir. I do enjoy the episode so far. I got a good achievement, a ransom's reward. But I like Asher. I like Sword Lady, whose name I don't know, because like, maybe she told me I just wanted to pay attention. Beska. That's it. And Malcolm, he's pretty awesome too. He's got a nice moustache. Um. The wall, of course. Hopefully we get to see Jon Snow. He doesn't know anything, but there we go. Of course I ain't Rack. Of course there's trees. And Essos. Where are we? Young K. Okay. Yep, you will. We get to see Jon Snow. Nice. Can we tell Jon Snow that he's prettier than women? Don't choose too fast. Don't choose too fast. At the wall part. Why are you going to tell me what to pick? Or stuff happens. You want me to not pick an option at all? What are you saying? Try not to spoil anything. There's a good funny part. At the wall. Okay. Hmm. Okay, you're going to have to spoil me, I think. Which part do I need, need to not pick? Or can I do it like I usually do and wait until people start talking? Or do I need to actually go with the, the don't pick an option and silence? I usually don't pick too fast, but Roderick, <gasps> you're right. He's supposed to be dead, and he's alive. Um, help! <laughs> hey, God, Hey, buddy. Hey. Damn foresters. There's a guy that says why he's at the wall. Okay. And then. Oh look, it's a body. Um, let's look at it. Hello. You look kind of comfortable there. Can you roll over? No. Okay. All that. That's terribly inconvenient. Put in the same card as my father. Hey, hey, Ely, Ely K, two thousand and one. How's it going, sir? That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. 
Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Royland. You again. <laughs> Home, oh, oh, nice. Dressed up like a I, lord, uh, a stable boy was... in Bannerman's clothes. You did this at Duskendale, and you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, the ice house oh, has oh, suffered the loss of oh. many good men, and you dare come here claiming to have Forrester dead. The Forrester, look at the colours. A fine <sighs> trick. I'm sure you ex leave <laughs> now. Boy, cool Kappa, yes. I'll them in the river then. <laughs> Um, you come back here again, you won't be leaving. You got that? I, I heard you. That was your sheep fucker. <laughs> the language. No, come on, I'm gonna bust it. Don't worry. I made it. Seven hours. What is it, sir? I'm alive. This one's still alive. You there? Who are you? Um, yeah, give me a hand. Or, or two. <laughs> it's me, look. Ryland. Roderick? Roderick? By the gods, it He's is. Live Hate Run Fox, how's it going, sir? Fetch the Maester, hurry! Fetch the Maester! Roderick! He recognised me under my red, messy face, full of blood. Now have some maggots, please. I know, it's Mr. Maggot Man, isn't it? It is. Oh, it sounds good. Wait, is this before or after? Ramsey Snow's around. That's the worrying thing. Man, the sound effects are amazing. My lord, you should not be awake. How about some... The milk of the yeah, milk of the puppy. Drink. Um Calm now. Yeah, we don't need that. Don't be stubborn, my lord. Yeah, I stubborn if I want to be. Roderick! My lady. And drink the milk. I know. It's a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. How is he? Will he live? Only if you let me finish my work. Let her. Yeah, come and see. I, I look lovely. So, my lady, I must insist that you leave. Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, he may never walk again. Roderick? <gasps> he refused the milk of the poppy. Oh, that's Roderick for you. Brave as always. But the pain must be... <gasps> Roderick! Hi. Roderick. I am good. Sounds like Mary Poppins. I'm looking good. Where's the mirror? Look like a boss. There's a picture. No! And myself. It's Talia. Hi, how's it going? I haven't heard that one before. It's nice. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I think oh, I lost you. Thanks for the extra pain. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm, I'll be good, actually. Go on then. Let's go in for the extra pain. Call me your sister. Here we go. See, I'm fine. I mean, I'm in good condition. How bad is Fighting it? Fighting shape. Bad and fit. Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. That doesn't matter. I've got another leg. And your face. I'm beautiful. I know. <laughs> I found worse. I look half as bad as I feel. Yeah. Don't worry, I'll be fine though. Well... At least you look better than you. Yeah, did. exactly. Thank you. What? 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 <laughs> Wait, you mean before or after? Something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan. Thanks, Lily. Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. 
and that monster put a blade through his throat. Damn it. Like it was nothing. <laughs> we'll get him. Ethan? How could this happen to him? We'll get him. Are you gonna be alright? I don't know. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> Alright, you can do it. You can, Talia. I know you can. <laughs> it's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. Mm. Okay. You need to let me worry about I'm worried about the, they're really going to come in on me when we're injured and finish me off, but... I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Yeah, I'm ready. Can you even stand? Yes. They could use your leadership. But if you're not ready... Let's find out! Only one way to find out. I'm pretty sure I can, though. Even if I can't, I'll crawl there. I miss On my you, hands. Brother. And they will learn to fear me. You can do this, Roger. I know. I know you can. Walking powers initiate. Here we go. Stand up like a boss. <sighs> Don't walk alone. Why not? <laughs> Roderick! <laughs> Fine. Starve them. Okay. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. Eh. Uh, I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. That's too large of a paragraph, Ely. It's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Please, Roger. Done there. I'll do, Rena, but try not to... Thank you, Talia. ...backseat me. I want to make my own choices. Otherwise, I'll get swayed by you because you've seen it before, and it's not fair. <laughs> That's it. I know, but I want to make my own choices. I want to have a look round. Yes, this looks good. Okay. Everyone will be so glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. Hey, Tom Tuffy, I didn't see you there. Kind of figured that after the warning. Yeah, exactly. Too large of a paragraph. <laughs> Time out, Reno. Oh, and I have an inventory full of things and stuff that I stole from the Maester. I love the wall. Look at it. The wall. Always wanted to see it, but not like this. It's a beautiful wall. It's like a castle, castle black. black. So this is the seat of the Night's Watch. It's pretty. Recruits at the gate. I love the episode. I don't know if I can mention which episode it is, but the one with the things and the stuff. It's an awesome episode. The one with the big battle at, at um...
at Castle Black. That, that episode was amazing. Decisions, decisions. Your arrival, is it? Another one for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. I like your uniforms. Can I have one? Giants, doesn't it? Maybe it was. You're new, here to take the black. Because mm. you got that look about you. Well, whoever you are, go see Frostfinger. You'll get you sorted out. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. So don't act all high and mighty with him. He won't stand for it. He's my favourite character. Um, I'm not sure yet. I think I like them all equally. <laughs> the labelist answer, but there you go. I actually kind of like them all. None of them are annoying to play as. Yes. And? Who are you, boy? Fine. I'm Gary Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Gary Tuttle of Ironrath. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the war? You're a thief. A raper. You abandon your post. Or do you just fancy dying someplace cold? I killed a man who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And you're no liar, either. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forest. Hey, Ricky! My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. Ricky, how's it going? Welcome back, ladies, hey, but... but... Then he asked us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle. I know all about you. I want some scissors. I want to do my nails. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. You don't know me as well as you think. Yeah. I know enough. Okay, then. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. A cot? Can I call it a bed? Understood. Baby sleeping carts. Not men. Oh, and Tuttle. Yes? Sooner or later, the night's watch will be your death. Good. When it comes, try to make it quick. I don't care. Bring it on. <laughs> hey, Ricky. Ricky, with your massive balance that you've got going on. Why have you requested it twice? That's, uh... You needed to request it once. And last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay. So, Malcolm caught a ship headed for... I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <laughs> and he's missing his arms and legs. <laughs> At least he can still eat his shit. The White Hill soldiers are drunk again. Mm. And we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. Hmm. Can I handle them? And pim slap them. Well, I say he's dead. And they've dressed up some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? Okay, then. And bring us some salted pork while you're at it. <laughs> Fill yourself up, you lazy fuck. Wine's almost done, actually. We'll need another barrel. Tell Sir Duncan to make. Is that him? Will that? Has to be. Doesn't it? Move it to my friends you call on the internet. <laughs> okay, Ricky. He's a blood 
bloody cripple. And he's leaning on a girl. Should have buried him with the corpses. It's a hot girl, actually. Forest is accursed. Had a well, run in with Walder Frey. Don't let go of your sister now. Yeah, I will. Thank you. What a disgrace. It's comfy. House. <laughs> Ricky is cool on the internet. There you go. Ricky's friends. We have business in the Great Hall. Right. <laughs> okay then. He looks. Go round. Oh really? Yeah, don't test me. Don't want to test me. Is that right? Because you look pretty sad to me. Oh really? <laughs> Kappa! Go on then. Get up and out of the way. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs or this house? Your face. My men may be few, but they'll die before you keep me from my hole. Yeah. Go on then, my lord. Hey, kitty. <sighs> Let's go. That was easy. What's she worried about? Oh, I, I would have killed him with my beard. I keep my spare fist there. You just announce it to the school. It's ridiculous. You're treating them like the guests. wine keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel. My lords. We would get on. They hate each other. Stop bickering. Roderick. My boy. Come, join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. Okay, no more spoilers now anyway. Like, the first episode you told me about the brain is Roderick and I was like, Roderick's dead, isn't he? So, it's that good. was a spoiler. It's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. Yes. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking, if you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I told you he'd be up and about. I'm not here to talk about my... Yeah, let's get to business. Perhaps we should get started. We should! Yes. Let's that talk is... about how we're going to kick Re Ramsey Snow's ass. You told me the state of our house. <laughs> then you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentiment. Um, He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lord, please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsey stole I've told you, I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a hostage. And what have you done to get him back? Nothing. Because we have no army. I will have order! Of course. Apologies, my lord. Yes, pay attention, guys. The White Hills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. If we don't have one. Not anymore. Summon our allies. Hmm. I'm afraid we have none. I feel like I should have gone with the second We've option. Heard from the Glovers since the Ironborn took Deepwood Mott. Houses Helliver, Grayson and Brownbarrow were all slaughtered in the Twins. Yeah. And the rest of our that allies are terrified of the Boltons. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as We're getting married already! Marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Mm. What are you Elena saying? Yeah, exactly! It's not up to them, it's up to Lady Elena. Is on her way here as we speak. I'll Lady use Lady. my... She's coming now! He's barely recovered. Wait. 
patrol. There you go. I, I should have chosen a silent yes, option, but there you go. A raven arrived this morning. Lady Elena is eager to see. Oh, we were here. If wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Yes. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground. We could. Yes. This marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. Of course she could. Why wouldn't she? We're talking about a marriage, not an Ironwood contract. I'll convince her. I'm certain I can convince it her. can. She's always been fond of yes. you. Yes. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. Right, okay, good point. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. Yes. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting their stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Um. Uh, <sighs> just handle it. That's the wrong decision, but I, I, I we could honestly. Fed, but take away their wine. Well, that'll be something at least. <sighs> Good. Now, if there's nothing more to discuss. I feel like I should have picked an option there, but none of the options seemed good to me. It's time to light the ironwood torch. Honestly, I didn't have an opinion. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, my lord. It's got to be back. It is. In my chair. Ricky! It's going to be interesting to edit Game of Thrones Ricky's Cool Edition. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. But. Ironwood doesn't burn easily. <laughs> but foresters have a way. Uh, I shouldn't laugh because it would encourage him, but. Him. <laughs> there we go. How is your song coming? So, anyway, this turned into Dating Simulator 2015 because we have to woo this lady now. It's not the same without. You're doing great. You're a fine musician, Talia. You will. You do an epic job. job. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. You're gonna make a beautiful song, and you're gonna sing it beautifully as well. It has been predicted as by Reno. About Elena. Yes. I sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over. What? The I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie. I don't need help. Maybe your sister can find a way to help. No, that's not right. All the wooing should be down to me. As a man, I don't need help from people to arrange it. That would be silly. It would be unethical. I'd lose ethical points. There we go. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. You're a medium. Is that the letter? <laughs> the Tyler Salem reference. Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Can't wait to see Make if you sure got game. Tell them we'll send all the leftovers. We'll have to see. And mm, something nice after that. April <laughs> was here. Um. Oh, sugar. Um. You and the children are ever in our thoughts. I wasn't paying attention to what I was supposed to be writing there. Dave quotes. And the seal. Here you are. Thank you. I didn't steal it. But I'm glad that you still had it. Not me. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Who's Sir Maynard? Ah, yes. Maynard the Fox. One of my father's favourite drinking companions. I died, what a bunch of dicks! <laughs> That's a Town of Salem quote! I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. <laughs> you know what, I've got too many sausages on this plate. My pleasure, Lady Mira. I can't remember what I was doing at the time, but then there was a lot of sausages. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asked that. I, I think it was related sure to the first quote, wasn't it? I died with a bunch of dicks. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? <laughs> I can't believe I said that. She's I think a it's, bold this woman. is the surprise of dying on the first night. Such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honour the betrothal. 
Wait, what? But it wouldn't be very discreet. You'd be forcing the. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like this. No, I, can we can we decline already? Mira, you have been so patient, so loyal. Your loyalty will not go unrewarded. No, I want to decline. I'm seeing grandmother today. She'll have some ideas about your brother's predicament. I'm sure she can. Okay, help. go see Elena. She's subtle, but very effective. Yes, I agree. Thank She's you. awesome.